slut on my knee. Yes. I saw deer back there. Deer, those aren't deer. Those are called vacunia. A vacunia? No, a V with a V. Yeah. Do you know what they're related to? Can you guess? The deers. No, <laughs> they're actually related to a llama. What? Don't they look a little bit like a llama? Have you seen a llama before? Well, yeah, because, yeah, they do. They got, that they're smaller. Yes, they are smaller. They are from South America and they're found in high elevations. These guys can adapt to very cold climates. They have a really big bushy coat that helps them keep warm. They're cute too. <laughs> they are cute, aren't they? I think they have a little baby face. They do have a baby face. And they have eyes like mine. <laughs> they do have eyes like yours. They're very beautiful, aren't they? They're quite fuzzy, aren't they? Yep, and you like to um, help them to what do they call it? They are here for pre-release site in their home country. And that helps them get used to the climate and helps them get into a herd. And then it helps them get back into the wild. So the pre-release site is the step before a release. And wow. then they'll get to know each other. Yeah. And they get to know how to be wild. And then they get introduced into the wild again. Did you hear that, Merrily Dawn? I heard that, Butch, and I think that's fascinating. Mm -hmm. How long have you been doing this? I've been doing this for eight years now. Is it the love of your life? It's the most amazing experience <laughs> to be a part of that whole cycle, um, to be part of something that will go back in the wild. That's really big. It's huge. Yeah. And even kids can be a part of it? They can. You can be a part too by just supporting this type of thing. That's what I'm going to do. I'm telling all my friends out there about what you're doing and how they could help you. That's a good idea. <laughs> Thank you. You're welcome.